Happy Friday. Happy Friday to you all. It's me, Ryan, back for another exciting video. Um, it's really exciting for me. And yes, do not adjust your screen. I am wearing an Always Be You shirt. Um, Dwayne Johnson wore it in Central Intelligence. I have a man crush on him. Many of you know. If you haven't, hey, no spoilers. So, you know, trying to be transparent. Um, you know, redefine masculinity, femininity. Um, so, you know, laying it on the line. Um, but today's video, right, coming from sunny California, uh, Northern California. It is super hot out there. Just came from a fresh cut. That comes from my Barber Slim. And that's actually the video I want to talk about today. I'm going to go ahead and minimize this window because watching this, that freaks me out. Okay. All right. Great. All right. So, you know, Bowtie Barbershop, uh, located in, off of uh, Main Street, Placerville in California, um, on the way to Lake Tahoe. It is a fantastic place. Um, I've been going there for quite a while now. Um, I've had quite a few barbers uh, over the time I've been there. Um, you know, uh, it's difficult for me to change. Uh, so, you know, I, I owe my um, my love and appreciation for that barber shop because my wife uh, was like, you need to start getting your haircut closer to home, right? And um, I haven't done that. So, uh, you know, I, I've, I, I maintain loyalty. I believe in loyalty, and uh, I try to stay loyal to my barbershop as long as I could, but, you know, I needed to make that change, so I did. Um, and I, you know, it was a very good decision. Um, if you're ever looking for a fresh cut, um, that's the place to go, you know. Um, I mean, the place is so important to me that I'm making a video about it, right? So, you know, you have, in order, right, you got bow tie. You've got Slim, my barber. You've got Ray Ray. Hey, Ray Ray. Hey, hey, Ray Ray. And um, you have Christian. Uh, and Christian is the uh, barber that uh, cut my hair, uh, my hair, my son's hair. Um, he did a great job. Um, you know, even though my son was moving around, um, you know, I took a picture of the board on that day, and we have a picture, uh, piece of his hair. Um, I'm going to put that in this baby book that's not already there, um, you know, and, uh, you know, moments create memories, right? So, you know, the place is fantastic. It's got a lot of character, right? Um, so if you've got people from out of town, um, you know, go there. And by the way, I'm not, I'm not receiving any funds of any sort. I'm just coming to you because I love and appreciate that place and I'm, giving it the respect it deserves, um, you know, and I want to talk about each and, and each and every barber uh, reserving bow tie, um, you know, the man uh, laughs, right? So, you know, again, Christian was the one who cut my hair. Um, he's got some tats and stuff, so, but he's, he's, he's a kind of a gentle giant, a giant in a way, right? Um, you know, he's got a good personality. Um, you know, and I recommend getting cut by each of those four gentlemen, the four wise men, right? Um, you know, and, uh, you know, he's, um, he's a good guy. They're all good guys, right? Um, he's, uh, he's great. So, you know, if you're, if you're a parent looking to, um, you know, get your child's first haircut, right? Um, you're in town or you're, you're local and you've never been there, it's a great opportunity, especially if he's a boy, a little boy. Um, I can tell you that he does great great work. Um, he, and they get a lollipop at the end, you know. Um, and I'm not one that condones sugar, but hey, you know, um, in the spirit of things, it's it's a good, it's a good experience. Um, you know, so we had Christian, right? We covered him. And then now we have uh, Ray Ray. Right. Ray Ray, he's a pretty put together guy. You know, he's got a bald head um, and a really nice symmetrical beard. Um, I think he cares a lot about what he, uh, how he, 
represents himself. Uh, he, he carries himself with confidence. Um, and he's one of the reasons why I started the channel. You know, he says I have a unique take on on um, things that I talk about, the topics that I have, you know, and, uh, you know, I, I owe, so thank you, Ray Ray, for, uh, you know, being the catalyst to speed this reaction or, you know, to um, speed this along, the process along and get me getting a channel. Um, you know, so I owe, I owe that to you and I'm already working on my accept, acceptance speech, right? So someday I'm standing up there, you better believe I'm going to bow tie barber shop before I give my speech, you know, um, cause I feel, you know, on top of my game, hundred percent, you know, the haircut is, uh, I get the bald fade, um, it used to be zero fades, but now it's just the bald fade. So, um, you know, there's that. Um, so, you know, we covered Christian, we covered Ray Ray, um, you know, well, a little bit more about Ray Ray, at least is what I, what I've observed, um, you know, verbally and non-verbally, he's, he's a good listener, you know, he's like, he's focused, um, you know, he's not loud and obnoxious or, or, you know, anything, so, um, I think he's still coming into his own, right, I mean, everyone's a little different, but, you know, different different characters, different uh, personalities, and that's what makes this place great. Um, so, uh, you know, that's that's Ray Ray. That's just my, you know, um, my interpretation. Now we have Slim, right? Slim, you know, he right now he's got this kind of curly cue going on um, with his mustache, and so I call it. Uh, you know, he's like the Monopoly man in denial because he's got, he's got a well put together look, um, you know, and I admire his uh, tenacity and his, his direction and, and his confidence to, to pull that off. Um, you know, he's, he's, uh, you know, he's a good guy. Um, it didn't start with him, but uh, I knew that over time. I would want my haircut to be done by him, and um, you know, someday Graham, you know, when he starts coming in there and more and more, he's going to be cut by by Slim, um, and you know, of course, bow tie. Bow tie is last because you'll see why. You know, uh, you know, all respect to bow tie, um, but uh, Slim, he, um, you know, he's. He's a good listener, you know, he, uh, he lets you unload your day's problems, right? I mean, he gives you a little, kind of the bartender in a way without the alcohol. Um, so if you're looking for a little advice or, you know, um, you're having a bad day, you know, he's a, he's a, he's a friendly ear, you know, he'll, he'll listen to you and, um, you know, uh, he's relatively new. He's not that new, but. You know, he's getting better at his cuts. He's getting more confident with his cuts. So, you know, I'm, I'm really excited for his future. All of them, really. Um, you know, his bow tie is apprentice. apprentice so to be the best, to be the best, you've got to learn from the best, right? And, you know, he runs a tight ship. I mean, just think about bow tie barbershop as, as a ship, right? And, you know, bow tie is the captain. And then you've got the, you know, the crew members and that boat. Is going to be super efficient and get where it's going safely if everyone works together as a team, right? And so, I feel like that place is, uh, you know, definitely going somewhere, literally uh, and figuratively. So, um, you know, there's that. Uh, there's like so much more to talk about with each individual. You know, I'm I'm learning so much. Um, you know, I'm talking about the men here, not the not the establishment that's coming up, right? Now, now, ladies and gentlemen, I talk about bow tie. Bow tie, he, you know, he has the bow ties on most of the time. You know, sometimes lately he hasn't had the bow tie on. Um, you know, he's uh, been wearing the jerseys. He's a big 49er fan. Um, you know, and I think he feels that every, everyone should have their own team, right? My team, team bow tie, right? Team bow tie, bow tie barbershop. 
Um, you know, I, I try to, uh, you know, keep sports. I mean, we talk about sports, that's fine. I didn't grow up with sports, so, you know, I don't have any closeness, fond memories of that. Um, so, you know, I, I, I enjoy playing sports myself, you know. Um, so, you know, getting a flag football team together, that'd be great. Um, it'd be kind of cool to, you know, to play uh, flag football or whatever with the guys, um, you know, and to, you know, I have a football now, right? So off of Amazon sale, uh, prime member, prime membership sale. And so I have a soccer ball, you know, and a uh, football. So, you know, send, send me a message, send comments, you know. Uh, I was, you know, looking looking to motivate, right, inspire and stuff, so, you know, it's, it's great, right, work so hard, eat so right, and then watch your body respond in a way that you never thought imaginable, right, and uh, on top of that, literally, like, on top of all that, you got to have a nice dome, right, your, your head, you know, and, and I feel like I'm wearing my barber's skill level on my head, you know, and, um, you know, I have, I have a life bar above my head if I could, and it'd be at 100%, you know, uh, HP, health points, right, if any gamers out there, right, would appreciate that, um, you know, so I always feel like on top of the hill, 100%, you know, got my uh, health buff, ready to take on, you know, whatever boss is uh, thrown my way, so big junior RPG fan, so, you know, role-playing game, by the way, um, so, you know, Final Fantasies, and right now, Octopath Traveler, that's another video for another day, because I love that game, I could be putting some serious math hours in, always discovering something new with it, too, fantastic, um, you know, uh, and so, you know, bow tie, going back to the barbershop now, you know, um, He's cut my hair a couple of times, you know, in the beginning I didn't talk as much and sometimes I still don't, it all depends on how much caffeine I've got going through my, my bloodstream, but, uh, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit more confident and, you know, I, I trust these guys, you know, I'm loyal, I have loyalty and so, um, you know, if you're looking for anyone to, um, you know, get that cut or, or, you know, you want to look your best, no matter what you're trying to do, that's the place to go. Seriously, it really is. Just give it a shot. I mean, you may have your doubts, you may have your questions and all this, but I mean, when you walk in that place, it's 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 like you're walking through like a Doctor Who, like you're, you step in a telephone booth and you're, you know, you're a million miles away from Earth. I mean, it's a couple of light years. It's great. And you walk in and there's so much to look at. Um, you know, you look up and they have, you know, bow ties and, you know, from end to end on the ceiling hanging down. And I'm sure that bow tie wore each and every one of them when he has, um, you know, people, uh, you know, hanging up there. And he's, you know, if a celebrity was to come in, right, um, you know, he's, he's, uh, he's actually cut a few musicians' hair. Uh, I'm not going to name any bands and stuff, but, um, you know. So you're, you want to look your best. That's where you want to go. And, you know, just like anything, sampling a fine wine or liquor or, by the way, I like to say liqueur sounds better than liquor. Um, you know, you know, sample each and every one of them, you know, appreciate them for who they are. They're great men. Um, you know, a lot of them are still coming into their own and it's exciting to see, you know, where they're, where they're headed and, you know. And I go in there weekly, right? I'd go in there bi-weekly if I could, but, you know, even weekly can sound excessive. But, you know, I find it as, as an investment. I do. You know, it's, um, I'm investing, and I like to think I keep the lights on, you know? I'm, I'm there, you know, and, and the prices, they're reasonable, you know? But you get so much more for the dollar value. You really do. For every $1 you, you pay them, you get 2 or 3 in return for sure. I mean, you leave there happy and and well adjusted and and confident you know and and so if you're 
you know, going through an interview or a new day at school and you really want to look look and feel your best, that's the place to go to. Bowtie Barbershop off of Main Street, Placerville, uh, near the free parking area. Um, it's just a great place. Um, they've got, you know, they've got Pendleton posters there. And before, I never even knew what Pendleton was. By the way, it's, it's a name brand type of flannel, right? Uh, checkered padding clothing, uh, you know, and it's, uh, they can go for, you know, 200 bucks a pot. I mean, these are high quality fabrics. I mean, you get what you pay for. Um, so, you know, and they have um, some 1950s, you know, haircut style things there. And today was all about the uh, under undercut or underfade or something. But uh, apparently got its start in Germany and then it uh, trickled out. Um, you know, from Europe, uh, you know, post World War II, um, you know, and I believe it got its, you know, its, uh, it actually hit the tipping point and it became a trend once Brad Pitt um, donned that, that hairstyle. So Fury, by the way, um, if you haven't seen it, uh, pretty good movie. It's pretty gritty, so I wouldn't recommend it for kids, but you know. And just as long as you the parents explain to the kids, hey, this is this is fantasy, you know, this is fiction. Um, you know, war is nothing to joke about. Um, you know, I'll talk about my experiences uh, in Iraq. Um, you know, and uh, Kuwait and and you know some other places. Be surprised, not a lot of people are asking about my military background. Uh, but you know, it, it's a part of history. So, you know, and I try to be transparent. So by, by definition, I, you know, I want to share that. And so if you're, you know, looking for training and that sort of thing, uh, getting back into shape, veterans especially, you know, I, I salute you. I appreciate the honor of your service and sacrifice to this country. Um, you know, freedom isn't free. I'm not going to get very political, right? I'm trying to keep that away because I believe in uniting, not dividing, right? So, um, you know, that's very important to me. Um, my philosophies, right? And that's and that's great. I mean, that's what we kind of talk about at Barbershop, too. I mean, shoot, today I was talking about, what, chemistry, and I was, you know, Slim, he's got this little bottle, tip bottle jar thing, and he has his caffeine uh, bond line. You know, see chemists out there going through chemistry through high school or college. They'll appreciate that. But I was explaining, you know, uh, intersecting lines, and that's what's understood to be a carbon atom. But I'll I'll spare that with you. So, um, you know, just educating, right? I mean, it's it's. I'm not trying to be arrogant. Like I know more than you or anything. It's just my. I know it. I might as well teach it, right? Um, you know. So anyway, I know I went, you know, path by path, and I kind of wandered off there, off the trail. But let's let's get back to the barbershop. You know, it's um, it's great. You know, it's it's pretty bright though. Uh, I'd say, um, but you know, that's, you know, I'm taking medications to make myself light sensitive. So you know, things are pretty dark. So, um, hopefully. You know, there's enough light where you're able to see me. It's not super dark. Um, but yeah, Bowtie Barbershop. I mean, each and every one of them. And they all have their unique their unique looks. So, I mean, they're they're good. And then the way the way they work around the, the you know, your dome, your your skull and, and they you know, they it's they're like Rembrandt's. Really, you know, there are Picassos and Rembrandts and Monet's. Uh, maybe it'll touch a Van Gogh, right? Um, so, you know, it's it's you know we're all canvases, right? Each and every member, or um, uh, uh, you know, person that goes in, right, to get a haircut, um, and it's it really is it's a unique gem. Um, and, uh, shoot, I would make wax, wax, I would have, in the wax museums, I would have, like, if there's anything local or whatever, I would have them in a, in a wax, uh, 
wax form, you know, the likeness preserved, right? Because it's, I feel like it's very historic. Um, you know, there's a lot of, that's what's great about, you know, the, the area in Placerville and I try to, you know, promote their local businesses and, um, you know, it's important for the community, you know, and, you know, I, I know I've gotten talking about a lot of stuff, right? Um, but, you know, kind of just, just sharing how I feel about it, you know, being honest. You know, I mean, look, I'm wearing a Always Be You unicorn shirt, right? Um, now, I haven't worn this shirt on the outside, by the way. It's, it's, it's been on the inside and I haven't been in the shirt, fit in the shirt for quite a while. So I'm pretty happy that I'm able to fit into it. A little unusual for it to be tight around the arms and the shoulders, but hey, I work hard for it. Um, you know, and, and the belly and the lower abs and, um, right? The, you know, that's usually the last part to lose. Thank our ancestors for that, but it's true. You know, arms is usually easy to uh, build up and, and preserve because there's not a lot of fat that can be stored there. Um, so, but anyway, right, that's, uh, that's away from both sides. Um, and again, you know, please, please provide comments, right? If you didn't understand anything or you have questions, you know, directions, uh, well, of course, you can just GPS it, right? Um, you know, but uh, it's, it's a great place, you know, and um, so now you know. Now you know about the place to go to get a cut, and you will, you will be, you will be satisfied. You'll leave satisfied. You really will, you know. It's human nature to question and, uh, I don't really know, and you know, but trust me, from a guy that you know was on the other side of the fence, I mean, I, I can relate, right? I empathize with that, and um, but yeah, it's it's great. I look forward to every Friday, um, you know, for those reasons. So, you know, again, Christian, Ray Ray, Slim, bow tie terrific people so um, you know those who know them lucky right uh, family you know they're they're great um, so you know you know I, uh, that's really all I have to say um, you know so check them out right Main Street Placerville um, California Northern California, uh, you know, on your way to Tahoe, right? So if you're going to a club up in Tahoe, going gambling, want to look good, or impress your girl, or go on a date, or whatever the case may be, job interview, they'll take care of you. They will. Um, so, yep, that's uh, about all I have for today's video. Uh, please provide comments. Uh, you know, questions, um, you know, things that you like, things that you dislike. I haven't got a lot of uh, constructive criticism, but, um, you know, I, I, I value and appreciate that. And so, you know, go ahead and put that in there. And for those of you wondering where Graham is, he's asleep. You know, for some reason, he falls asleep to the soothing sounds of the shower. So he's asleep in his uh, little little basket in there whatever that little thing on the, on the floor is called. Um, but anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed today's video and found it informative. Um, you know, talked about, you know, bow tie barbershop, right? And, and, you know, how I feel about it. And I walked you through how I felt about every one of the barbers, the wise men. And um, now it's up to you to, you know, choose your, choose your wise men. Um, you know, so, all right, well, I will talk to you next time. Um, that's all I have. So have a great day. Have a great weekend, right? Friday, wherever you are in the world, right? So weekend, happy weekend. And, um, I'll see you next time. Thank you.
Oh, yeah. And by the way, uh, before I uh, close out, right? Do it for the right reasons, right? Have the right reasons for the right reasons 2016. So, uh, all right. Thank you. Have a nice day. For real this time. <laughs>